Hey guys, it's Carrie. Welcome back to the channel. And look what I went and did. <laughs> so, I've been obsessed with Steffi Love lately, and I don't know what happened or why it happened, but it happened. And um, I looked up stuff online, and I found out that there was this thing called the Hawaiian Camper. And from what I gather, it's retired, but I don't know that for sure. It is not available on the Steffi Love website, the um, the German website. So I think it might be retired, but I don't know. Because I was able... I saw it... Where did I see it? On a couple of sites online. One of them was Macy's. And it was going for like a hundred and something dollars. And I was like, well, it sucks that I'm not going to probably get that. Um, but it's cool that I knew it existed. Well, um, there's a... I think there's two different colorations. There is a uh, a pink and red one. or Or... Yeah. And then there's a blue and white one. And I found the one that I really want. This is the one that's the teal what color one. Anyhow, I found this at my local Marshalls uh, for a lot less than what it's being advertised for online. Here's the side here. Uh, I'm so excited for this. So I guess apparently the shower's outdoors and it, it folds into that. And then she has a sleeping thing. I I, I don't know. I, there's 50 plus pieces. There's stickers. There's cutout stuff. I'm pretty excited for this. I don't know if I have to put stuff together. It looks like it's pretty together, but here it is on the back here. Here's a picture of her. And it also shows two dogs, so I don't know if we're getting those two dogs. And just to let you guys know, I've had a lot of caffeine today, so I... Yeah, so try to stay with me. <laughs> um, here's uh, some more pictures. And then, of course, the whole like box is done in this tropical theme, because it's supposed to be the Hawaiian camper. Um, yeah. So, what I found out, too, online, there's no tape here, is that I think this is actually licensed by Volkswagen, because it's like a Volkswagen camper-ish thing. So, let me see. I'm just, just trying to get this uh, out of the box. Out of the, I think I should be able to just slide this out, but I don't know, guys. The boxes are always pretty tight with, uh... Oh, there is tape. There is tape. Also, I forgot to note that there's two sticker warning stickers on here that says two for two warning warning choking hazard choking hazard small parts not for children under three toy contains a small ball not for children under three so they had to have a special warning sticker just for the small ball and then one for the other small parts that's very interesting I wonder if they had an issue with with kids under three in a small ball. Anyhow, here it is out of the box. Um, it does have a nice tropical background, but I want to get it out. Uh, lots of ties, like this, on the bottom. Here, right there. And um, here, we've seen this before. This is about the warning and the choking hazard. for small parts, and then it shows you a person using scissors to cut out the clothing. Here's our stickers to go on. Our camper, I guess. And I wonder what these ones are for. I guess we'll find out later. Hmm, maybe. <laughs> I don't know if there's any other instructions in here, but uh, we're going to go ahead and get it out. Be right back. So before we get into anything, um, I just we're just going to cut these out. Um, because apparently we got to cut these out. They go to something. Oh, it looks like they're pre-cut. I don't know. But yeah, so I think these might be like rugs or runner rugs or carpets or something. So let's get those cut out. And then we're going to start looking at our camper. So with the scissors or the cutting device that I was using, this was probably really hard. It was really harder than it was supposed to be to get to them. But once I got to them, they, do, they are pre-cut. But here we have our camper van here. So um, this was what I wanted to look at. So it looks like this passenger side door does not open um it has the good illusion that it does and there is no window here uh and i don't know if this adjusts no but it is a boingy material so this is not going to break off which is good i think it's good are there stickers to put on there hmm i wonder if there is i don't see any that's okay because there are no reflective stickers on there for the mirrors so but we have handles, and the handle here is stationary. We have stickers on this side of the van. So it says Steffi Love right here. We have a clamshell, a pineapple, some hearts, a little fish blowing bubbles. Um, 
And then we have a clamshell again, some hearts, uh, sunglasses, some um, starfish, some more hearts. And we also have, is this, is this, is this part of the window here? I don't know, it's a cactus. And then uh, a sun, another fish blowing bubbles, some stars, a little piece of sea, sea kelp or something like that. I don't know. And then here is a coconut tree, which is an awesome sticker. And there are transparent stickers, so you can barely tell they're stickers. They look like decals. I guess you call them decals instead. But it looks like these doors do open, so that's cool. How far? I don't know. I don't want to break it. So this one's open like that. There was a little bit of a... I don't know if it was supposed to snap like that or not, but I, I, I snapped it. Um, and it, we have a white... Uh, like a pinkish white interior. But I think also... It opens up up here somehow. So let's turn it. Let's turn this around and look at the outside of it. Still, we're we're still looking. We're still looking. The front here, we have a little license plate that says Steffi, Steffi, and then Love and Small in a dark pink. The bus itself has it's it's teal blue on the bottom, and then white on the top with light pink highlights. The little V here. These headlights are stickers, so isn't the um, license plate. These are, ah, these actually move, I think, but I'm not sure. There's there's tape on there for some reason. There's something ta oh, taping, uh, that must be how it converts, but these are a little bit more of a, um, a rubbery plastic, and uh, they're like a dark gray or a medium gray. I don't think they actually move, but it's a good detail, I think. Um, so over here we have our other side mirror. Same color scheme going on, but it's plain over here, so there is no stickers. But that's what they give you these for, and I wonder if that's what these two windows are. If, like, these are for those two windows. The paneling there. So we're going to do some sticker work uh, before the end of the video and show you that. So I think I am going to sticker it, because it looks weird on this side with no stickers. And it looks like the front door does not open either. So, But you do have access to the top here, which we also... It also does come with its own exclusive... I think, exclusive to the set, Steffi Love. It's kind of hard to know exclusive when it comes to Steffi Love because a lot of the times their their face sculpt and hair colors are all the same. There is tape here holding this open, holding this shut here. Because I think I saw in the, in the pictures on the box that this opens. Now, as far as I know, there's no instructions on how to do this. So, we're on our own here. And if there are instructions, they're not in English. Here's some more tape holding that together. Hopefully this tape doesn't peel off any of the paint, but it doesn't look like it. Looks pretty painted, pre painted pretty well. I don't see any um, too many blemishes or anything like that. All right, it just opens up like this. We got all kinds of stuff in here. Ah, and a rubber band holding it together. I think I'll just snip it. Uh, ooh, an umbrella. And uh, I think this is the tabletop. So we have all of our pieces over here. And uh, oh, our chairs. We have some foldable lawn chairs. Um, and everything that's in here. We have a bag. Another bag. And oh that's the chair. It stays there. That's the other chair. It's hanging out. I don't see that it's attached to the floor very well. But maybe that's what some of these things are for in there. <sighs> Alright, it's gonna be a second. I think this I think I think I think this flips around. Yep. So this flips around. I'm gonna get a chair. This flips around, and I think this opens somehow. I don't know how it opens though. That's the problem. Uh... Ow! Somehow that opens. Can I just say or add that this is very confusing, and I wish there was instructions back to this. Maybe there is instruction somewhere in one of these bags. And if there isn't, maybe there's something that can help us get to it because 
this is supposed to be where the where the bathroom or the outdoor shower is and this is really amazing i like that they made this hose clear it's it, but it's definitely very fragile so you gotta be careful with that but it comes off so you can like spray your feet or spray your body or something after you you know just a little spun shower oh my goodness what's all this stuff okay all right all right here's all our kitchen stuff i think whoa whoa all right this is crazy this is crazy i want to show you this all one by one but it, there's too much here there's too much so you can freeze that and take a look but what I'm going to do is I'm going to set everything up and then I'll just give you a tour. I think this is supposed to be a burger, but I'm not even sure now. This is an apple. This is a steak. <laughs> uh, and there's the bananas. I like the bananas. Um, and I don't know what these are. I think they might be hooks for something. Maybe hooks that go, maybe these go up here, up here somewhere. But I'm, I'm hoping that there's an instruction manual somewhere. All right, what's in here? Oh, this is some sort of glass, uh, well, it's plastic. It's clear plastic and it's, it's got a little bit of blue tint in it, but I think it's supposed to be like a coffee table top. Is that the only piece that was in there? Yep. Ah, all right. Whoa, more stuff. All right, yeah, um... I am going to take a brief moment and be right back. Um, hopefully there's a reason why I can't get anything open and don't know what anything is. <laughs> be right back. I'm so confused and overwhelmed. So I'm actually going to show you this in parts because I don't get it. So here's some Adirondack chairs, Adirondack chairs that do fold up. So I guess you can store them away in the camper when you want to. Um, and this piece really here is kind of a complicated piece for a uh a lower end piece so you have the hot pink base and then you have the uh rod or the uh the part that goes into the base i don't know what it's called and then you have the piece of the umbrella that goes into the base of the umbrella and then you have your umbrella that is the hot pink and the light pink table that has the table legs that you had to put on and two water carafes that have removable lids uh, a couple of coffee cups in a, a mint green, a mint green plate with a hollow burger. This burger is, is ginormous. It's so not scaled in it, what it should be. I think this is supposed to be a burger. It looks like it. Um, we have forks and knives that are also in that, that mint green color. We have a, a hot dog in a bun, which is really cool. And then we do have a hot dog without a bun to put on the grill. And we have a steak here we can put on the grill as well. Um, and I guess we have apples. An apple and a banana, if you want to put that on the grill. We also have this grilling fork. And we have all these, but I think these are going in the kitchen. So we're going to show you those later. Um, ah, we have a couple of, bottle of bottles of olive oil or wine or whatever you want to call that. in like a light, light green. We have a picnic basket. I don't even... Oh, 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 the radio. The radio here that fell off this coffee table looking thing that we don't know where that goes either. So we're going to move all this furniture that's on the outside. Oh, and the grill, of course. I might have this upside down, but it looks better this way because if you take this off and flip it... Sorry, I'll just put that inside there for now. It looks kind of weird and bland, but I don't know. Whatever. So uh, we're going to put the in the outside stuff aside and we're going to check out the interior of our camper and figure out how to work that kitchen. All right, guys, I figured it out. So this corner comes down like this and then the legs fold out like this. And I think this is supposed to be like a the loft, the bed. And maybe this goes here. I think that goes there like that. Um, there must be. Oh, here's another package that... Came out of there. What's in this package? Oh, here's our puppies. Oh, hey. We did get puppies. Look at that. Okay. <coughs> I don't know what they are. Um, I think that they're like little cute little mixed breeds. That's what I'm going to call them. 
We have a chocolate one, and then we have a tan one. And they're cute. They're really cute. I was wondering if Steffi was doing this trip on her own. So, we have those, and then I wonder if there's anything... So, here's our kitchen, and I, I wonder if any of the doors open. Is this supposed to be our fridge down here? I don't think any of these doors open, but they might. But give me a second, guys. Give me one sec. Oh, and, and the back seat is removable. I don't know how, how we're going to get it to stay in there, but it looks like there's some... There's some little things here where that something's going to mount down there, I think. Maybe... Uh, I don't know. Um, <laughs> Alright, let's look. Let's take a, an aerial look of the inside. This might be better. Okay. So here is our sink. Um, the, the piece, the faucet piece, is a different type of plastic than the rest of it. It is a little, little mobile. Uh, you want to be careful with smaller kids. That'll probably pop off and get lost. We have both of our burners here and our knobs that are painted white. Surface top is pink, and then a white faucet. I don't... And then we have cubby space under the faucet, cubby space underneath the burners, and I don't think this fridge opens, but I can try to see if it does. Hold on, guys. My conclusion is that I don't think that this cabinet or these cabinets are removable, at least not on purpose. Uh, they are different plastics. Like, this is blue plastic, and this is dark pink plastic. And I think if I pried it open, I could probably pull this off, but I don't think it's supposed to come off. Lots of frustration for this because I don't... Okay. Pre-warning. If you're going to set this up, you should set it up on a flat, hard surface, not a bed like I'm using right now. Because everything is just rolling away and static electricity is sticking everything to my fingers. But I'm going to give you the gist of things. Okay. So this cutout kind of one goes here. It's supposed to go here. Um, this is her little lounge area, sleep area. So this pulls down. <clears throat> so she can play her guitar that it comes with. Now, we've seen this guitar before with the first set of Steffi Love that I ever opened up. Uh, it was, the um, I think it came with the Vespa and the, the car. And then we have, or she can read a book here. So this is just a plain, regular old, and this piece comes out. I got confused because I didn't know what it was, but I looked at the thing and I think it's her, I saw her reading. So yeah, there's that. Um... <laughs> and there, these pieces, I didn't know where they went. Hold on. I didn't know where these went. Uh, the only thing I could see on the box is they show one up here holding our little tea kettle up. So if we're not having tea, we can store it right there. And then we have our pot, which has a removable lid. We have our frying pan, which has a removable lid. We have a square uh, spot here, I guess a, a square container where you can put like your meats and stuff in. And then that also has a removable lid. Uh, we have a couple of cereal bowls. We have our... You, you can either call those wine wine bottles or olive oil. I don't really know. Some sort of bottle of something. Uh, you can pretend to be have it whatever you want. You have four different jars, uh, two different styles, that also have removable white lids. Um, I tried to have tea here, but it wasn't working out for me for the surface that I'm using. Underneath, you can see that other cardboard cutout. I used that as a... Um, as a, a, a quilted rug. That chair is supposed to go forward or you can move it around. It is mobile. I believe the chairs come out as well and you can kind of set them around this table so it becomes a complete eating area. Um, over here, this is our wash-up station. So this actually pops up our little, our little sink here. It's supposed to stay there. I guess you just, I think you can push it in there, but I'm not going to do it. Not, not at this angle. Anyhow, it pops up and sits there, so you can also shower yourself with this little thing here, which we looked at earlier. So you can shower yourself, and there's a sink. And then here's our little surfboard, which we've also seen this design before in the first one we opened. So some repeat accessories. I have no idea where this goes, guys. This was in with the accessories. I don't know if it came out of somewhere in here and it's supposed to be in there somewhere. Um, I guess I'll figure it out later. But either way, we also have a light baby blue picnic basket here. That is supposed to, I guess it's supposed to look like wicker, wicker, but it does open. Now this you have to be careful. This has the type of hinges that could possibly wear away with time. 
So you probably only want to open it every once in a while to put stuff in, but but let's get it open just for the video's sake here. Opened, and there it is closed. Um, what else do I want to show you? I'll show you the interior of the front here before we take a look at our girl. But let's just dump everything all on the floor, like uh, like that first. Let's close this. Maybe we can get a better look. Okay, let's move these so I don't lose that. Put these down so it doesn't look like a mess. All right, so let's get our girl out here. I think, like I said, I think these chairs just come right off. Yes, they do. Okay, the chairs come right off. So you can actually turn them around and face them this way and use them as chairs for to go with that. Pink seats have a uh, black seat belt that is adjustable. You can kind of just pull that out and pull it in so you can adjust it to a smaller frame. Uh, here is our interior here. I don't think any of this comes apart, but it may well come apart because we have uh, some tape here. I don't know what the tape's on there for, but I guess we'll find out. There's two of them. Two pieces of tape there. Does this dashboard turn into something? We don't know. Or is there just tape there to be there? Anyhow, there is the there's the whole, the oh crap bar right here. We hang on to that. Looks like we have a cassette tape player here, our little glove box, and that's its own piece. And that's it for the front. And I said, like I said, I think these these pull out. So we're gonna face them this way. And everyone's gonna be around the table for a second. First, we could take the seatbelts off. We want to, but we're not going to. We're actually gonna put everything back the way it was now, because um, I think we've actually looked at everything. But I want to see how it packs away. Here's the stuff you love that came with her. Uh, you guys know the draw with the face. Same face, same eyeshadow. <laughs> Uh, she does have a, a little bit of a different hairstyle uh, than some from the past, but pretty much the same. So the bangs are side of the, swept to the side. They're long and grown out. Um, they, are, they are elastic band behind her head. And then she has actually, they put it in a ponytail. So that's a little bit, that's the different part. But uh, she still has those uh, bright platinum highlights on top of a uh, darker blonde hair. She's wearing a one-piece dress that is pink with blue and light blue hearts on it and then blue and light blue uh, monstera leaves. Uh, she's the articulated version. I don't know. I think there's more. more. I think there are different Steffi Loves that have more articulation than her, but she's got articulation at her head. So um, you can make her head move back and forth a little bit side to side, but not much. Uh, and she has articulation in her arms, so you can make them move out and this way. She has articulation not in the not in the waist, but she does have articulation on the hips, so you can make her stand, you can make her sit, you can bend her knees, and you can point her toes. Uh, she is wearing high heels that are teal. I don't think we've seen this time yet, or at least we haven't seen this in this color yet, and or I haven't. And then she does have sunglasses that are threaded to her head, so those are staying on there. That's okay. They can be for head decoration anyway because they do not have transparent lenses. And you know, guys, all know how I love that. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm going to decorate this van. And that's basically all I have for you guys today. I will show you a picture of how I decorated it because I think I'm going to put these on the windows. I think that's what it's supposed to be. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.